All right, guys, out at the hangar. I'm gonna do uh, adjustment to the SDS computer today. I'm gonna add um, fuel trim uh, so I can adjust individual cylinders uh, with uh, leaning it or enriching it. And uh, last weekend I went for a flight, checked the plugs afterwards, and one cylinder was looking a little lean. So this is why I'm, why I'm doing it. Um, that way I can monitor EGTs during flight and uh, adjust individual cylinders. So see how we go. So the problem I got, computer is right in under the dash here. So it's gonna be a bit of a challenge to get to. So we'll see how we go. As you can see, I need to get in there, pull the top off the uh, computer gold box here. I'm going to have to uh, move a few pins around and solder a joint. It's going to be fun to get to. I thought this was a good idea at the time. I need to pull this jumper off which is H6 and I need to solder a bit of solder from there, from H8 to H9, which then sets up the uh, the fuel trim. And then I've got to change a couple of wires in this Molex plug here, um, just so I can make sure that they go to the individual cylinders and the four drivers actually drive the injectors, um, give it the right, the right amount of fuel to the right cylinder. Alright, so that looks pretty good. Now you can see I've just bridged these two here. So that now turns on my uh, fuel trim. Obviously there's, there's codes as well that you need to get from SDS. Um, you need to get some codes that you actually put into the programmer as well. So all I did there was basically it turns the fuel trim on, uh, but it still won't work unless I put in the code from SDS. So um, can't do this without the code. All I had to, to do that. was just to confirm that I had the right wires going to each individual cylinder. So I, I know that when I'm adjusting that driver on that injector, that it's actually adjusting the right injector. So. Um, that's all I had to do, so I've got a bit of wiring, a bit of clean up, and uh, we'll give it a run, see how it goes. Alright, so I've uh, done a bit of flying around and uh, trimmed the, um, the injectors to individual cylinders, and this engine is running really smooth. I am super impressed. Well, I just got back after doing the fuel trim and far out. What a difference, um, idle smoother, run smoother. Obviously one cylinder wasn't quite right and uh, now they're all running perfect. My idle actually went up a little bit as well. Uh, so obviously at idle it was compensating, the other cylinders were compensating for it too. So yeah, great result.